Okay, I'm gonna show you real quick what I packed in my hobo bee today. This is the first time I've taken out a hobo bee and it worked out pretty well. Um, stuffed, I don't think I can put anything else in there. This is like my special occasion bag, so I'm gonna take it to showers, weddings, nice restaurants, stuff like that. I, I doubt I'll take her to the park or pool or anything. I've got a little bit with me that's gonna help. Um, <laughs> I was trying to record this video earlier and he actually set up for the first time, so that was really cool. I had to start over though. Um, okay, so in this zippered part here, I have my cell phone, and on the key fob, I have my keys along with my pocket knife and fingernail filers. In this zippered part back here, I have a notebook with some uh, pen and a pencil. I also have two coin purses, one with mommy stuff, um, moisturizer, hair gel, and this one I have restaurant stuff, mints and toothpicks, wisps wet ones, Listerine. I also have my wallet. Um, I like this one in my small bags to use in my small bags. It's got places for all your little cards. This to keep them secure. ID. I like this area right here because I put wallet um, receipts and grocery lists and stuff. And it also has a zipper part for your, your change and your um, folding money and stuff. I really like that. With my bigger bags, I use wristlets, and I also use quicks, so I put my wristlet in my quick if I need to just grab and go. Um, I also have in here, I make my own hand gel, hand sanitizer, but I like this because um, it's thin, and, it, and it's, it's big, and it's thin. works out pretty well. So. <clears throat> here is the Hobo Bee. This is what it looks like inside. And this zippered part here, I have, um, I just have a, like one of those little folding hair brushes. Um, I might put a, a little spritz bottle with some water in it to help me with their hair, smooth down their hair. And this mesh pocket here, I have boogie wipes that I've condensed down. And I also have um, a little coin purse with individual wrapped wet ones, boogie wipes, hand sanitizer, wipes, um, I have antiseptic wipes, any, any wipes, boogie wipes, anything you can think of, I've shoved it in here. Oh, uh, those little dabbles. And in this one, this mesh pocket here, I have just a little wash rag for dribbles. I have, these are flushable wipes for my toddler. I would also have, um, seat protectors, toilet seat protectors here, but I'm out. I have my ouch pouch, um, which I have Neosporin, Tums, cough drops, sunscreen, antiseptic wipes. Oh, and then I have those little, um, the colic, uh, liquid things. Those that work really well. This chamomile, I'm not sure what they're called. And then I have some hand sanitizer wipes in there. Um, over here in this mesh pocket, I use a quicklet for toys. That's about the only thing I use quicklets for. Um, but in here I have like a little car and some teething toys. Just some little little fun things. Um, I can just hand this to him at the restaurant and let him have at it. And then also in that same pocket I have his um, teething toy. Okay, and back here in this long zippered pocket here I have... Oh boy. I don't know if I can get this. I have two pack and plays for my son, my older son, and my daughter, Angry Birds and Hello Kitty. And I also have the little coin purse with um, candy stickers and balloons in there. That's all I have back there. Okay, and here I have my, um, it's a large set piece. This is stuffed with restaurant needs. I have wet ones, um, disposable bib, and placemats. I also have a be neat, be neat. I have a uh, pouch for my baby. Uh, two cereal bars. Um, I have one of those kids me things for my son. A uh, bobby pin that's not supposed to be in there. And I have those spoons that attach to your thing. To your pouch in there. Okay, so at the very bottom of the bag I had an extra diaper. I have no extra clothes in here. I'd bring a car bag full of a bigger ouch pouch, first aid kit, um, more diapers, more wipes, change of clothes. So if he has a blowout, I'll have everything that he needs and I'll just carry him out of the restaurant with a diaper on. It would be fine until I can get to the car. Um, in my, this is my 
I have this that um, one of the nice ladies at the on the customs group made for me. She's um, making me um, a charcoal rose one that I'm waiting for. It's going to look gorgeous in here. Okay, I'm sorry. Anyway, so I'm getting a, a new one of these. It'll match. It'll look gorgeous. Gorgeous. So this is all the stuff that I had in there. This is unbelievable. Um, so we're going to show that out of the way. He's got my large set piece. So I wanted to show you how I did this. Um, <clears throat> this has a little handle on it. So this is my little grab and go. If I'm just going to change my son. I'm just going to take this whole thing with me into the bathroom. And inside here, I have underneath the um, booty pod... I have taken a diaper and I have, let me show you what I've done here. I have, this is a three, size three. I have um, diaper rash ointment, which I use rarely, but it's nice to have. I also have a garbage bag in case I get a poopy diaper or blowout. And I have a changing pad. Uh, disposable changing pad. I, I usually, I won't use these every time, but if I do need them, it's nice to have. If I don't use them, then I could just put them back in here and put the wipes on top. Top. But with this, I have everything that I could possibly need with me, and it's very small and it's very condensed, and I can just um, pull it out. So, And then I have an extra diaper in here, just in case. Oh, and then I have my teething necklace. So, that's it. That's what I have in my in my diaper bag. It's going to be fun putting all this stuff back in there.